Hey guys, it's your boy Logan HDI, and welcome back to some more Roblox. Today, we're looking at another developer's old Roblox games, and we're looking at B.O.'s Top Kip right here, and he is the creator of Pokemon Legends. He's made a couple of different Pokemon Legends games. He's got the 2015 version, he's got Pokemon Legends 1 and Pokemon Legends 2, but he's also got a bunch of other older games, and it looks like a couple of Sonic ones, so they're gonna be super sick to check out, and it'll be cool to see from, like, where he's started to like where he is now and if you guys are new to the channel make sure you subscribe to never miss a video but i saw something really kind of weird here so pokemon legends was made on the 7th of the 17th 2010 and that's actually the earliest game that's on his profile but also there's this other game right here naruto shippuden which was also made on the exact same day so he made the two games on the same day and this game looks pretty cool i've never like watched the naruto show or played any of the games let's give this a go uh, okay, I haven't watched Naruto, but this does not exactly look like Naruto from what I've, like, seen pictures of. <laughs> this, this looks really weird. What even is this? I don't know exactly. I don't know what this is at all. Um, yeah, this, I don't think this is Naruto. When I, when I joined, when I was on the play, when I was on the game page, I actually saw there was a lot of dislikes on the game. So I guess this is why, because the game's kind of broken and it kind of doesn't work. I guess he was focusing more on Pokemon Legends rather than this game. Oh, well, you can spin on the balls, though. That's kind of kind of cool, but there's literally nothing else to do. Oh, instructions. You can double click player you guy on the left screen. Um, oh, here we go. Why would you have to double click it? That's kind of pointless. And then, oh, now I'm in the game. But then still, there's not much here. <laughs> oh, man. But you have to double click the, cl uh, the character thing on the side to open it. It should just be a single click. But um, we look so weird. <laughs> what even am I? I don't even know, but we look terrified. We look like from a horror film or something. Oh man, that's really scary. Uh, there's, there's health things on the side here. I just use them all and they're gone. Um, and I don't think there is any much much else to do. Oh man, wait, what's that Alexis? Wait, he's, got, he's a horse. Wait, wait, what? He's a horse, he's like a, a samurai guy. I'm kind of confused. But uh, this game, it's interesting. So his next oldest game was Slender the Eighth Pages Test Zone, which, whoa, it's got 13 dislikes. No, this is the next oldest one, which was made like a month after those other games. But uh, let's give it a go. Whoa, okay, there's, there's Slender Man right there. Uh, Slender Man, whoa, what's happened? Uh, I'm really confused. Okay, actually, I think the game is glitched. I'm pretty sure Slender Man, yeah, I think what's happening is Slender Man is at the spawn area and he's just, we, we keep dying. We keep spawning back in and he keeps spooking us so there's literally like nothing we can do this game is horrible so after that one this one here i think was made not too long after that it's called destroy the giants four giants new giant this one actually looks pretty cool it hasn't got many dislikes so this this could be cool oh okay so we're here and there is there's nothing here <laughs> oh no i've got a bomb and i've got a, a missile this feels a lot like uh quite a few other games that were made around this time as well like i think there's one that i played it's like just Destroy the giant Pikachu. You picked noob. Wait, what's happening? Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, actually, I've played a, a, quite a few games like this before. Yeah, I think they just uh, copied. <laughs> We've got Snowman with us. Hey, let's try to destroy him. Blow our rockets to do it like nothing. This is this is not too good. Come on, Snowman. We can destroy this big old noob. Oh, we're starting to break down. Oh, there we go. We're breaking down his legs a little bit. We're almost there. I think the bombs are doing the most damage, actually. Oh, no. I just blew myself up with a bomb. Okay, well, it's going to take a long time for this uh, giant noob to be taken down. Maybe I could buy some of these things. Uh, I need points though. Hmm, I don't have any points. Okay, we've got an issue, but uh, this is just not falling down. His legs are so strong. He's got all oh, my legs and my armor gone. What the poop? Oh no, just completely died out. Ah, uh, so yeah, this game's kind of cool. It probably would have been quite cool back in the day. But now it's uh, not too interesting. So after that, he didn't really make anything for a couple years. So there's nothing like public on his profile. And this game here, Super Roblox Smash, was made in 2013. So it was made like three years after his last game that's public on his profile. But Super Roblox Smash, this sounds pretty cool, but it's in beta <laughs> release. Oh, no, it hasn't been updated in a while. Let's see what it's like. Whoa, this looks actually pretty cool right here. Select a character. There's Pikachu. We can pick Pikachu. 
Pikachu. <laughs> I am Pikachu. But um, what do we do? Oh, we attack, don't we? Uh, how do I attack? <laughs> this is why what the boom is happening. This is so tricky to like see what I'm doing because it's just like, oh, no, we're doing damage. We're actually doing damage to it. Oh, boy, oh, boy. That, okay, that, that attack just is poop. I think Thunder is pretty much the only attack that can really like work. Oh, man, this is really tricky. No, I think I just got wrecked over there. Oh, man, this is pretty cool, though. I actually kind of like this game, but it's kind of tricky like to tell like where you are because you can kind of like, I can move back and forth. I think in Super Smash Bros, you're gonna move like left or right. I don't really know because I've never played Super Smash Bros before. I probably should, but I haven't. Um, but it's kind of tricky to control. Like one of my attacks, like you don't even know where it's shooting off. Like it just shot off in the distance that way. Um, so like Thunder is my only attack, and it's like I don't think I'm doing any damage to anyone. Oh, this is a pretty cool idea. I actually kind of I like the idea of the game. Let's change my character up because my character is. Not too good. Pikachu isn't too great in this this game. Let's choose all oh, Mega Man. Hopefully he'll have some cool like shooting abilities. Where should wait? Where am I? I think I might have just died straight away. Oh no, there I am. You can kind of see I'm um, that blue orb around me jumping around. Uh, let's do my blast one attack, which bam does nothing. Blast two attack. None of my moves are doing anything. Oh man, I think that's why this game is in beta. Just like. My attacks aren't doing anything. Oh, man. I think this might be the best game so far. Oh, I just got destroyed there. I think it might be the best game so far, apart from Pokemon Legends, of course. And then after that one, a couple months later, he made this one, Sonic Animations, which sounds pretty cool. Oh, and there's actually Sonic, but there's, oh, there's, oh, so I say there's no animations, but it was just loading in. We've got animations now. They're pretty cool. Pretty cool animations. We can do a spinny jump. Oh, no, I think I just wrecked myself. I think I meant to, like, be jumping over those blocks. Oh, no. Okay, let's try this out again. I can choose different characters as well, but let's try this. Oh, we can jump so far. This is actually, like, pretty cool. I actually like this. If there was, like, a Sonic game like this, that'd be so sick. Wait, what's that? Oh, it's a jumpy pad. Jump. Oh, and we made it, although there's nothing here. <laughs> no, I think there's a different map. There's this one here, which um, is just like a town. There's not really much to it. Oh, man, it'd be cool if you like, actually finish this game. It'd be cool to like play a Sonic game that's like a complete game. There's, like I like this, but there's just like nothing to do. But the animations look pretty cool. I guess it, that's what this game is about with the animations. What, wait, what is that right there? I don't know, but there's also other characters, which I've got no idea. I don't really know the Sonic series too well, so I've got no idea who the other characters are. I know there's Sonic. Oh, I'm like flying. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Uh, that's a pretty cool animation. Then there's this yellow one. Oh, wait, I think it's kind of glitched. I think I'm actually like two characters at once. So if I go back to Sonic and then into the yellow character, I think it kind of, yeah, it's kind of glitched. Yeah, because it changes my body to the yellow character, but my face is still Sonic. Oh, no. Oh, this one looks pretty cool. And he just flies as well. <laughs> oh, man. So just all the animations are just flying apart from Sonic. He's got a proper... Oh, no, wait, I'm flying now as well. Um, okay, I think I might have glitched the game up a little bit. And, like, all the different animations are kind of, like, glitched. And I don't know what's happening, but we're, we're flying now as a Sonic. So that was pretty cool. And I found this one, Sonic FE. It was made in 2017 near the end of it. So this is a couple years after the animation game. This one, oh, this one looks pretty cool. Oh, whoa. So yeah, it's using the same animations. And it looks like there's actually quite a lot to the map. Oh, this is cool. Okay, we get more little adventure right here. Oh, I like this. I really wish you made this into a full game because that could be really cool. Or if like someone made like an obby out of like all the Sonic stuff, I think that could be really cool. Like had like a bit of a story to it. Kind of like, um, you know, those, those, uh, those like story parkour things. Like there's that SpongeBob movie one. There's the Captain Underpants one. I forget who makes them. I think it's Shovelware. The people that make those games, they do really good obbies. It'd be cool if they made like a Sonic, uh, uh, like story obby that'd be so cool but this is pretty cool and then we've got a little jump pad oh wait the oh, that was pretty glitchy right there that was uh yeah not too not too flash but um this is pretty cool i do like this there's extra maps as well so oh here's the town map again oh actually wait a minute so this is the um oh wait, wait what is this right oh that's different again so okay i don't i'm kind of confused now the first map oh that was up there this map is what was on the other animation that sonic animation game this doesn't change at all but this one here this is completely changed and now there's like there's rings which i don't know even know if i'm collecting them no i think i am yeah i am collecting these rings that's pretty cool and they've added in a lot more whoa so yeah you can see like how they've updated this uh version of the map right here because they had this part here and it kind of just like stopped after this little section right here but now there's like all this other stuff up here they got 
Yeah, look, I just stopped here before. Now they've got all of this. Hey, this is cool. You've got to, like, actually think about what you're doing. Oh, that's kind of tricky. Oh, no. I think I might have. No, have I done it? Oh, no, have I done it? No, no, no. What, what did I just do there? Oh, no. I kind of just kind of just died. Wait, have I died? No, I haven't died. I'm still alive. But, like, oh, man, can I just, like, jump back up the side then? Ah, oh, I couldn't do it. There's one actual pretty bad thing. If you fall down into the water, you've got to just reset. And it takes, like, a long time to get all the way back. No, exactly like this. Ah. Oh, and there's a character right there that costs 45,000 rings to get. At the moment, I've got 45. I need to get 45,000. Oh, that's going to take, like, literally years to do. So, yeah, we're not we're not going to do that. But I want to try and complete this obby. Oh, let's do this. I'm a little bit more scared this time because I know if I fall, I've got to, like, run it back for a long time. Oh, no, that's impossible. Oh, come on. That's kind of annoying. I've got to reset go all the way back. Ah, I give up. I can't do it. Oh man, this game was made in 2017 as well. You'd think they'd have some sort of like respawning system in here, but you can just like run through all the, the water area. I guess you could like skip half the map and like uh, maybe jump up one of these. Nah, you can't. Ah oh, man, the game's pretty cool though. I do like it. And after that one here is this one right here, RR18. And this game was inspired by Amisha Ryan's Roblox Rush from 2019. So, I uh, don't know what that means, but let's give it a go. Oh, okay. They've got some speed boosters right here. Press E to boost. Oh, wait, wait, whoa, this is so weird. I can just like keep spamming E and it just like boosts me through. Um, oh, you know what they've done? They've built in a respawning system. Oh, but it's kind of broken because you can just run, run along the ground and then, oh, wait, I kind of like, I just skipped like half the map right there. I don't even know what I'm done. Oh, no, what, what, what am I doing? What even is happening right now? Oh, no, yeah, we're kind of, we kind of broke the game. Oh, it's uh, a little bit broken right now. Oh, my goodness, I'm like, I'm literally flying right now. Uh, um, yep, I have broken the game. I'm just like spamming E and just <laughs> keeps boosting me through. Oh man, this is this is not this is not too great. Oh man, but at least they built. Oh oh, I did part of it. Oh no, at least they built in like a respawning system mode. That is that is one plus uh, that they've done here. But it's uh, <laughs> it's kind of confusing. Wait, what if I boost? I go backwards. Uh, I don't know if I just jump regularly though. I can do it. Ugh. Okay, that's we're doing. Okay, we can do this. We can do this. No, we can do this. Oh, and then press E. Boom! There we go. We've done it. We completed the map. Oh, so if I just keep spamming E, it just like boosts me in like a random direction, kind of. Oh man, we're fine. We're off. So that was pretty cool. But his last game here is S O T C, which was made in uh, 2018, so like literally just like a month ago, kind of. So this will be pretty cool to see. It's only had 35 plays though, but let's give it a go. Whoa! What the poop is this? Hey, we got some people coming in. The animations look pretty cool though this actually looks pretty sick i don't really know what it is i don't know if it's based off something or if like it's like an original thing i'm not sure there's not much of the map either there's <laughs> literally just this oh man but the character does look quite cool and the animations are quite smooth as well that's pretty cool but he doesn't really have any like full games on his profile apart from pokemon legends i guess like he just made pokemon legends and just mostly focused on that and built like pokemon legends 2 as well but it's cool to see his other games like all the different stuff that he worked on the sonic games are pretty cool and this one's pretty cool too but hopefully you guys liked today's video if you did smash like button comment down below subscribe for you and i'll see you in my next video see ya